Hey everybody, Dave here from Hot Dog Johns, and today I'm going to do a little taste testing of some spicy brown mustards. At Hot Dog Johns, we pride ourselves in using the best, the finest, and the freshest ingredients and toppings. So there's a lot of choices out there when it comes to spicy brown mustard. I chose four of the common, uh, common things that you might find in your super. I'll show you what we have. So first of all, We've got what we've been using, which is a Wilbur sweet and spicy mustard. Been using that so far this year. Next to it is a French's spicy brown mustard, Golden's spicy brown mustard, and Walmart's finest great value spicy brown mustard. All about the same price, all things that you can find in your supermarket. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sample uh, a bite of each just plain, and then we're gonna sample uh, some of each of them on a hot dog, one of our Sugardale hot dogs with some Silver Floss sauerkraut, which is a great way to do it, the spicy brown mustard and the sauerkraut. Okay, first one I'm gonna taste is uh, the Wilbur's spicy brown mustard. This is what we have been uh, featuring. It doesn't focus if I'm in this crazy cinematic mode, so I'll put it next to me. This is what we've been using so far this year. I like it a lot. I'm gonna try it on its own, a spoonful of it. Great. Tasting, a lot of flavor, a little bit of texture to it. The French's spicy brown. And remember, we gotta go like this, otherwise it goes out of focus. French's spicy brown. Okay. Initially, I'm not as crazy about this one. I'm not as crazy about this one. It has a, a little bit more of a yellow mustard taste to it. Not bad, but just not quite as much character as the Wilbur's. This is the golden spicy brown mustard that we're going to try. Okay. Okay, that definitely has a little more character to it than the French's. Not as much texture as the Wilbur's, but a really good flavor and great value spicy brown mustard. We'll give this one a shot too. Okay, pretty similar to the Goulden's very similar to the golden so the wilbur's definitely has it in when it comes to the uh the texture also flavor i'm, I'm kind of um i'm kind of leaning toward the sandwich pal right now um with just the blind test now i'm not it's not blind what am i talking about with just the plain test there's nothing blind about it because i know exactly which one i'm eating okay so now we have the assembled hot dog pieces this is a sugardale hot dog on one of our regular buns with the silver floss uh, sauerkraut. Each one of these has one of our four spicy brown mustards on them. I'm going to try them, see how they work with uh, the dog. I'm going to start reverse order. I'm going to start with uh, Great Value Spicy Brown Mustard on the hot dog. Okay, it's good. It's a good mustard. It's a good mustard. It doesn't hide the flavor of the dog. It enhances it. The sauerkraut comes through. Quite good, quite good. Golden spicy brown mustard. Let's see how the golden holds up against uh, the great value. Mm. Definitely has more flavor than the great value. So far, I'm gonna say that one's a step above the great value. Wrenches spicy brown. Mm. So interestingly enough, on its own, the uh, the French's I wasn't as crazy about, but it works really well with the dog. Um, the flavor of the dog, the flavor of the crop comes through. Uh, the flavor of the mustard comes through. So Golden's and French's both really good, S different uh, tests. The Wilbur's, it's a sweet and spicy, so it's a little bit of an unfair advantage because this one does have some added sugar to it. So if you're concerned about sugar, uh, this one does have a little bit extra, but that makes it a sweet and spicy mustard. Let's see how it works on the dog. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Okay. Let's talk about the results. Just my personal preference. Uh, yours may be different. I, I'm, everybody's tastes are different. That's why we have so many choices at Hot Dog John, so many topping choices. And unlike politics, there are no wrong choices. Anyhow, uh, getting back to the mustard, the Great Value Spicy Brown Mustard,
great, affordable, uh, works well. It didn't get like a tremendous amount of uh, zing to it. Decent mustard flavor, decent texture. Golden worked definitely a little bit better with the sauerkraut. Tasted about the same as the great value when it was on its own, but it seemed to work better on the uh, on the dog uh, with the sauerkraut. So I'm, I'm going to give a leg up for the Goldens at this point. French's uh, was surprised on its own. I was not as crazy about it. Had a little bit more of a vinegary. Um, mustardy, uh, yellow mustard taste on its own, but worked really well with the hot dog and sauerkraut. Complemented the sauerkraut, complemented the hot dog. I think my personal favorite is our, our Wober's Sandwich Pal Sweet and Spicy Mustard. You will notice this bottle is just about empty because this is the one we've been offering with our hot dogs so far this year. Um, I'm gonna say this is the one we're gonna to continue to offer. Uh, I prefer it above the other three. Nutritionally, if you're worried about that, uh, there's, there's 10 calories per serving. This has five, so you're getting five extra calories. Um, but this is gonna be what we're offering at Hot Dog John's. You go to a Hot Dog John's, the, the one and only Hot Dog John's in Indiana, and if you ask for the spicy brown mustard, you're getting the Wobers Sandwich Pal Sweet and Spicy Mustard. We love it. As always, it's a great day for a dog. We love you. Serving up love, one bun at a time.